Welcome Legendary Proxy Faithin to Zenless Zone Zero in D&D. I'm the Zeo Striker Bangboo guiding you through this build. Today's commission will be about the Deputy Chief of Hollow Special Operations Section 6, Yanagi. We'll start by picking Yanagi's species, which will be human. She gets proficiency in history and gets the feat Resourceful, which gives her heroic inspiration after a long rest. Yanagi also gets Origin Feet that'll be Magic Innate, Wizard, and the spells will go off of Wisdom. She picks up the Cantrip Shocking Grasp and Booming Blade, and the first level spells Witch Bolt. Yanagi finishes with the Giant and Orc Languages. Next is Yanagi's background, which is Scribe. This gets her proficiency in Investigation, Perception, Calligraphers, Medicine, Persuasion, and Stealth. Yanagi finishes with a plus 2 in Wisdom and a plus 1 in Dexterity. Now finishing up Yanagi's stats. She'll go Standard Array and get an 8 in Strength, 15 in Dexterity, 13 for Constitution, 10 in Intelligence, 14 in Wisdom, and a 12 in Charisma. Thanks to Scribe, Yanagi wraps up with a 16 in both Dexterity and Wisdom. To start things off, Yanagi will be a Ranger. At level 1 Ranger, Yanagi gets proficiency with Animal Handling, Insight, and Survival. She gets Weapon Mastery and picks up Quarterstaff Topple and Club Slow. Topple on hit lets Yanagi attempt to make the target prone, and Slow on hit reduces the target speed by 10 feet. Favored Enemy gives her Hunter's Mark for free and can cast it several times a day for free. She picks up the first level spells Goodberry and Ensnaring Strike. At level 2 Ranger, Yanagi gets proficiency in Sylvan and Infernal, plus Expertise in Perception. She also gets Druidic Warrior, which gives her the cantrips Shillelagh and Guidance. And she picks up the spell Cure Wounds. Level 3 Ranger gives Yanagi her subclass being Hunter. She gets Hunter's Lore, which lets her learn the strengths and weaknesses of those marked by Hunter's Mark. Hunter's Prey gives her a technique for single or multiple targets in combat. Colossal Slayer and Hordebreaker, and Yanagi can switch between them after a long rest. She also picks up the spell Animal Friendship. Level 4 Ranger gives Yanagi an ability score improvement, which will be a plus 2 to Wisdom, making it an 18. She also picks up the spell Speak with Animals. At level 5 Ranger, Yanagi gets extra attack, which lets her make 2 attacks instead of 1 during an action. She also gets access to second level spells being Locate Object. At level 6 Ranger, Yanagi gets Roving. This increases her speed by 10 feet and her climb and swim speed equal her regular speed. Level 7 Ranger gives Yanagi defensive tactics and gives her a technique for single or multiple targets. This gives her escape the horde and multi-attack defense, and she can switch between them after a long rest. She also gets the spell Pass Without Trace. Level 8 Ranger gives Yanagi another ability score improvement and picks up the feat Warcaster. This gives her a plus one to wisdom, making it a 19, and advantage on concentration checks. Can use spells for opportunity attacks and can cast spells with things in both hands. At level nine Ranger, Yanagi gets expertise in animal handling and insight. She also gets access to third level spells and picks up elemental weapon and lightning arrow. At level 10 Ranger, Yanagi gets tireless. She can give herself temporary hit points a few times a day and on a short rest, she recovers from exhaustion. Proxy, if you're liking the video so far, make sure to like and subscribe so you can meet other proxies, but back to the video. Level 11 Ranger gives Yanagi Superior Hunter's Prey. This allows her Hunter's Marked Damage to do the same damage to another target within 30 feet. She also picks up the second level spell, Locate Plants and Animals. Level 12 Ranger gives Yanagi another ability score improvement and gets a plus one to both Wisdom and Constitution. This makes her Wisdom a 20 and her Constitution a 14. At level 13 Ranger, Yanagi gets Relentless Hunter, which stops her from breaking concentration on Hunter's Mark when she takes damage. She also gets access to 4th level spells and picks up Locate Creature. At level 14 Ranger, Yanagi gets Nature's Veil. This allows her to harness nature a few times a day to turn invisible for a turn. Level 15 Ranger gives Yanagi Superior Hunter's Defense. When she takes damage, Yanagi can use a reaction to give herself resistance to that damage and any other damage of the same type until the end of the current turn. She also picks up the 4th level spell, Freedom of Movement. Level 16 Ranger gives Yanagi another ability score improvement, being a plus 2 to dexterity, making it an 18. At level 17 Ranger, Yanagi gets Precise Hunter. With this, she gets advantage on attack rolls against the creature currently marked by Hunter's Mark. Yanagi also gets access to 5th level spells and picks up the spell Steel Wing Strike and Commune with Nature. At level 18 Ranger, Yanagi gets Feral Senses. Nature grants her blind sight up to 30 feet. Level 16 Ranger gives Yanagi an epic boon and she'll pick Boon of Combat Prowess. This increases her wisdom by 1 to 21, and when Yanagi misses with an attack roll, she can have it hit instead and can only do this once per turn. 
She also picks up the third level spell, Revivify. Yanagi's final level is level 20 Ranger, and she gets Foe Slayer. This increases her Hunter's Mark damage from a D6 to a D10. That concludes the mom, I mean, the Deputy Chief of Section 6, Yanagi. She's a bit clumsy at times, but without her, Section 6 would fall apart. Let's go over the choices for the build. The main thing I wanted was Lightning for damage and Steel Wing Strike, which led to Full Ranger. We got some early spells to do damage with lightning and things like that, but the unique thing was getting shillelagh so we could have good melee options that didn't rely on strength. Hunter was sort of the best pick for the multi-class just because it does good extra damage as well as giving her options for, you know, defenses. But thank you Proxy for watching this video. You can find more commissions to watch here and leave a comment if there's anything else you would change for this build. But don't forget to like and subscribe too. Until next time, I wish you all a great morning, evening, or afternoon. Ciao, ciao.